Hello and welcome to day three of Ice Tales from Scratch. Here's the deal. There are some things we did well yesterday and some things I don't think we did a great job on. I think we did well at getting a lot of Calphite King kills, which was good, but I made a critical error in my judgment. I thought my gear was as good as it was gonna get. I didn't think I'd be able to make any improvements. I don't think that's true. I think there are a ton of things that we can do to actually make our cake kills a lot better. And, and the biggest thing that's standing out to me is the fact that my gear keeps degrading because the minions. So what I want to do is I want to make enough money that one, we don't need to go buy overloads 800 times and we just get a bunch. But two, I also would like a ranged weapon of either a sun spear or a rail crossbow so that when the minions spawn, I can just corrupt the whole pile. That is going to be so much easier than worrying about like how to aggro them, how to not aggro them. So we're going to do that. Um, outside of that, we need a KK drop today. I'm not giving up on the plan. I'm not changing the plan, but uh, we've got to get it done. Reclaim Ivan. I would like Sun Spear, the Reformed Spear. And I guess we'll just go right to KK, probably. I, Yeah, I guess. Why not? Let's do it. Okay, for cash to blow his RNG on Vindicta. That would be solid. The good thing with this, it's a long enough challenge that I'm hoping the law of averages kind of works out and we end up in a, good, in a good spot. If I was willing to upgrade my swords to plus five or even to plus three, that would probably be good. But because I'm just doing Calphite King right now, I've got a Karras on anyway, there's no point. We're gonna get a Dragor first and then that'll save us some time in the long run. I did say I was gonna start with KK, but let's get some raw sharks and cook them first. So we'll do QBD till we get a shark drop and then we're gonna lock ourselves at Calphite King for probably, I don't know, rest of our lives. 40 sharks on the first kill. That's actually beautiful. And eight rock tails as well. That's sick. That's actually, that could not have gone better for us. Let's get like a couple more shark, cook them up, and then back to KK. Although there is a certain irony of, of trying to get sharks so that I can do KK to get more sharks, but it's fine. Royal piece, maybe? Ooh, let's go. Royal torsion spring. That is our first piece. Oh my God, you'll be really funny. We spend 600,000 coins on a sun spear and then immediately get a royal crossbow. Ooh, Royal Sight back to back. Wait, Cash got all four pieces in 16 kills with no dupes. We have to do it in four. Is it time for a back to back to back? It is not, but 30 Onyx Bull Tips. We take those. Oh my goodness. Wait, that's three Royal pieces in four kills. What in the world? Yo, this is happening. This is actually happening. All right, team, it's time to go where no PVMer has gone before. It's Calphite King time. Welcome to the Sunk Cost Fallacy, featuring me, your host. Today, we're gonna be sinking more time into a boss that is gonna provide you with nothing, but with slightly better strategies and maybe even slightly better luck. Here we go. Okay, first KK kill today, very slow kill, not well done at all. And we're getting sharks, that's all right. I feel like it might be Dragor time. A one in 746? Can we talk about this really quick? Y'all wanted me to go to Ice, some of y'all wanted me to go to Ice House with Elder Rune. You guys are like, yeah, just get a, just get a head start. I, I wouldn't want to watch that. I wouldn't want to do that. I wouldn't want to be associated with that. No shot. We're gearing, dude, we're gearing up. We're gonna gear up completely. Are you kidding me? But yeah, based on those drop rates, the other thing worth noting too, this series isn't gonna take 700 years. But what is gonna happen is the person with the better gear is is who can do more kills per hour is gonna win out. More likely than not. The gear setup is gonna be everything in this challenge because the drops are rare. We are pretty dry out of gore, I will say. Quite, quite dry at gore indeed. Um, remember one of the things I said in first year is like three quarters of the first years will end up pursuing engineering and, and making that their thing. And then one of every four of you guys are not gonna end up doing this. And I remember thinking, look, look at my roommates and thinking, wonder which one of them, which one of them suckers isn't gonna finish their engineering degree? It, it was me. It was, it was me the whole time. Bro, I just wanted that. I wanted to change the narrative, okay? The narrative around Calphite King is boss sucks, boss drops nothing, boss provides nothing but sadness, boss sucks, and that's it. And I was gonna go to KK, have a really enjoyable, fun time, a happy time. We were gonna we were gonna befriend the boss and befriend each other at the same time, make some friends along the way. It was gonna be awesome. I forgot one critical thing when I was kind of making that plan, which is that Calphite King is Calphite King, and this boss is actually just hot garbage. Good. Bye, Mr. Calphite King. Is it time? We've done like 70-something kills. 
Nope. Thank you for the sharks. What gear am I moving for before I go? Um, I'm not sure, honestly. I know it's gonna be full augmentable though. Like I'm okay in bandos, I'm okay in, in next gear, like Torva. I don't think I would ever make masterwork from scratch. Bro, I, I had five seconds on my sign and my prayer didn't switch. Awesome. Love that for me, Badoodle. For, I hate this game. I'm capping on effigies, so I never have to get another stupid effigy from this stupid freaking boss, dude. Kelfight King, I need a drop. Please, chat's making fun of me. They're bullying me. It's having a lasting impact on my development. Do you want me to grow taller than five foot six? Because the stress of being bullied by chat is, is preventing everything from working here, man. Are you kidding me? Wait, wait. Gaming! The best way to play RuneScape is do whatever you want to do. Do exactly whatever you feel like and enjoy yourself. Which I know is like cliche, but there are so many guides that tell you, oh, you got to do this and then this next and this next. No, you don't. It's so uptight. It's a game. I can't believe we're still here. It's been so many days. I can't believe we've done like approaching 100 Calvin King kills with this setup. Killed the bus. Got the Dragor. Won the cha challenge. I still like the plan. I still think KK was the right move. I'm just like, it's getting a little annoying that we're still here and it's three days in. Like Cash is now doing, Cash is doing next and I have not moved. Ha! Bro, no shot, I got that res. Wait. I need the shirts for heals. Give me, give me, give me now. No, 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 no. We're gaming. <sighs> Whew. Thank God that wasn't a Dragor. If that had been a Dragor, I might have died. Oh, no. What? At what point was I facing that way? Um. Did you see the guy that made the... Someone, someone's going to know what I'm talking about. Someone made an auto clicker, but they made it like physically, like a mechanical auto clicker. Imagine setting that up to get 99 magic. <laughs> it's the drill just going all day. Boring. Look how loud it is. Yeah. Um. <laughs> Can you so, imagine? I just want to show you. All I did was take my. I took my mouse. <laughs> we are not off to a great start, team. I've got to say, worth mentioning. 744 sharks. I want you guys to know that's just from today, by the way. That's just from today's Calfight King. This is day three. That does not include days one or two. 744. Man, it sure would be nice if I could get an offhand that would help me kill Calfight King a little faster so I can spend more time here. All right, don't heal is first instruction. Second instruction is provide me with an augmentable weapon. Okay, so there's good news and there's bad news. The good news is my Kelfight King kills just got slightly faster. The bad news is uh, that that's an offhand, so I actually have to go back. Um, but there was good news. The good news was pretty good. That took like 110 kills. I'm just, I'm happy to get a drop. Honestly, my gear broke. The timing on that. Okay, hold up. Okay, I got to elk some stuff, repair my gear. Perk this Drygor, and then we go back to Cal Calfight King, I guess? <laughs> what is this? Why is my... My head like an owl. If you want one in the back of my head for... Look, just just take a screen for next time. I think I'm going to do precise offhand equilibrium main hand. Because it won't matter. I'm not going to go on Aftershock anyway. It would have been better to get a main hand, especially after like the amount of kills that we did. But we hit the drop table, and it's a 50-50 at that point. That's kind of like what's going to happen to Cash when I reset his defense level at the end of this. Goodbye, Calfight King. Good first kill today. Do we go back to back? Can you guys imagine? No! Help! I'm on 100 life points! Oh my god, the clutch! Wait. No, 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 no. Okay, wait. I got an idea. I got an idea. Why is my invent full of blubber jellyfish? Wait. That was one minion and now it's three. Okay, watch this death cost though. Look how clutch this is going to be. I appreciate Calculated? Wait. Is that a royal crossbow? 
Wait, that might be. That might be a full real crossbow. That's a real crossbow with no dupes. So let's get that forge right off rip. I'm gonna stay at QBD though for a little longer because we actually didn't even get a uh, get a shark drop. I feel like actually doing some rack skills wouldn't be a terrible move. I would be open to it if you guys think it's not a bad idea. I just, I like having a fairly set plan. I don't want our plan to be, oh, just do a bit of everything, go all over the place. Like I'd like to have a, a very specific set of, set of moves planned out. And Rax kind of feels like throwing a dartboard at the map and, and, and seeing what happens, right? If we get lucky, we get a hilt, then, you know, we should go for a leg piece and all that. And then if we don't, then we don't. Feels like a potential waste of time. 40 sharks get in. Okay, QBD is being really, really nice right now. That's fantastic. 48 prey pods. Wait, that's such a good drop. Another row piece and 40 sharks. So that's really sick because I believe this is like a, yeah, it's a 90k elk there. Oh, wait. Help. Did I do it? What do you mean on Forge? I clicked on it. Um, excuse you? What? Oh, no. No, I can't pay a death cost. I can't pay for death. Every QBD death, I'm going to remove another QBD guy that I made. Deleted. Actually deleted. I thought that was a drop. Onyx bolts are honestly really, really good, though. I'm happy with Onyx bolts. And see you, bro. Oh, my. Mm, okay. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's not ideal. Three. I can't. I'll get for 300k. I can't. We've now done 150 KK kills. We've had our second Drygore drop, but it's another offhand. So uh, guess what? We are going back to the Kelfight King because yeah, we have to. All right, it's time for the back-to-back. -back, which is also the only reason I didn't give up. The series is scripted. Okay, the series is not scripted. Can Cash get a minute? This is not good. This is really not good. This is really not good. I've done 150 I mean, kills, by the way. Like an actual I, 150 kills. How many have I done? I've done like 34. Wait, you've had two off hands and a main hand and 34 kills? No, I've had two main hands and only a main hand. Why does this Ugh. happen so consistently every freaking time? <laughs> there has not been a single challenge where you've even gone to drop rate. You have not once gone to the drop rate. There's, it literally has not happened once. Cash has spent the last five days. Doing Nex, Vindicta, Hellwer, QBD. A tiny bit of KK. Like the tiniest minuscule amount. And he's got better loot than I do. I'm happy that you got a drop. You know why? <laughs> why? Because you're going to go 800 dry a frozen core of length. I've got a Zyrite bow for like 600k. <laughs> like, you know, you want the first legs at least? Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> I've, I've literally just been at Kel Viking for five days. You want to hear my perks? Yeah, sure. Let's hear it. So I am biting three cautious. Okay, it makes sense. Yeah, trophy taker it. four, play ahead in two. Mobile venom blood, scavenging three, and looting. This is the guy I'm losing to. <laughs> I just want. I just want to be abundantly clear. One, two, green shield. That's so rude, honestly. So uncalled for KK. And goodbye. You know, you can make it up to me though. Let's go, we got it! Oh my god, 160 kills were good! Let's freaking go, dude! I'm free! I'm actually free! And that's the best one too. The prayer bonus, we're just god gaming. We're absolutely god gaming. Let's freaking go, dude! It was all worth it in the end, maybe, unless I lose, in which case it was not worth it. But right now, we're winning. We're on top. Let's get it, dude. So here's what we need. We need time-worn components. Please, dude. Please give me time words. Let's go, dude. Eight time-worn components for gaming. Ready? Done. A main hand Drygore with equilibrium. An offhand Drygore with precise. We are perked up, ready to rumble. Now that I've got a set of Drygores, we have some decisions to make. Initially, I felt that a magic setup would be the best option overall for the Arch Blazor. But before we proceed and start working towards that, I want to do my due diligence and investigate the idea of a melee only setup. In order to help me decide, let's try a 500% Enrage Arch Glacier kill in whatever gear I have right now. 
If I feel like it's passable with some melee upgrades, we'll completely ditch the idea of using another style and we'll fast track all the way to the Archglacier with melee. Going forward with melee only presents a bit of a risk, because I know with similar gear, the other two combat styles are better at the Arch Glacier. They'll get you faster kills and easier kills with fewer supplies used. At the same time, I already have the Drygors, and that's a massive time save if I think the kills are good enough. So we're not looking for perfect here, we're just looking for completable. No shot am I dying to the hug. It's called a hug. That's so non-threatening sounding. So how much damage do I take if I miss this? Oh, a lot. Okay. Watch me get a court. Oh, that would be really funny. I mean, first kill tell us from scratch I got a drop, I think. My first 500 claim, I got um, I got the DSTB. That ended up being the win. Why not use your best in slot melee gear that I don't have? Would be awesome. Would truly be awesome. Oh my god! What the f- Oh, Jesus! That hug really do be hitting though. I want magic. I want magic gear, guys. I think. I don't know. That wasn't like the worst experience of all time, but it was definitely difficult. That was not an easy situation. That almost an eight minute kill. Okay, so now this is where I X log and then I submit a lost item claim and then I get 30 million. We need to upgrade our gear for sure. That's effectively what that told me, but we can streak from zero to 500 with the setup. That's awesome. Let's get some upgraded gear. Let's get some power gear. Let's get some damage. Let's get a better way to deal with the minions and then we'll be solid.